Good morning, you all. So, I don't even know what day it is. I've completely lost track of time. Um, but today, we are going to... The sun is red in my eye. We are going to take a ferry out to St. George's Island so that we can go to Clearwater Beach and then go to the Crystal Caves today. Um, and then we're seeing Melinda Doolittle, who was uh, top three on American Idol. Um, she was the one uh, the year that Jordan Sparks won. So we're seeing a concert with her tonight. And then we're supposed to go to some club thingy afterwards. That's supposed to be like the islands like go off night. We're out till like 3 a.m. I don't know. It's a lot going on. Um, today is our last full, full day here. Because um, we're here tomorrow as well, but we leave at like 2.30 and then we start making our way back. Um, so yeah, I am having a blast. I have no idea really, cause I feel like I've been just doing a lot of like montage videos and not talking that much, but I've had a great experience. Uh, more, nine times out of 10, I'm probably just gonna end up filming an entire separate mukbang where I actually talk about my experience and stuff. Cause I feel like I've been just trying to capture images for you all, and not, I haven't really been able to talk that much in the videos, um, but yeah. Anywho, I hope you guys are having a great day today, and uh, I'm going to bring you guys along with me today, so enjoy. Bye. So you guys, I am currently on a ferry right now making my way to St. George's Island. Um, so I hope you all enjoy the view and I will see you guys soon. Hey guys, so we are on our way to Crystal Caves in Bermuda, and I just wanted to um, let you guys know that so that if anybody finds this footage, that means that I have died, and um, I love all my Simply Foodies. Um, Sean has probably left me on the island. Um, and yeah. Like a drinking hand. Yeah, you know, so um, if anyone finds this footage, that means I'm gone. Okay, thanks, bye.
century that you would have seen right up there in that section, right? But as they hit the boat down into the area, they went looking for it. They just kept looking and looking and looking. But after a good bit of looking around, they couldn't find their boat. They eventually came across this hole in the ground, and they figured the boat might have actually fallen into this hole. Now, as they got a little closer, they realized that it was much, much deeper than they had originally anticipated. And they now come to the conclusion that maybe it wouldn't be such a good idea to just go and jump right on in. And so this time, these two boys decided to go all the way back home. They got as much rope as they could find in a kerosene lantern. They returned back to the same hole and then decided that it would be a good idea for them to lower themselves about 85 feet into the earth, for which we're standing right now without telling anybody where they're going, right? So these are some very intelligent kids to work with, very smart. If you can imagine, back in 1907, you wouldn't have any stairs to walk down, right? Hey you guys, so we have just gotten to Turtle Bay Beach in Bermuda. Look at how beautiful this beach is. It's just us, it's maybe about maybe 10 people here. So we are about to lay out, have a beautiful day. Um, I will try to give you guys some close ups so that you guys can see it. Bye. guys we are out here out here look at how beautiful what's the name of this one private beach <laughs> true i think it's called T T T T turtle bay Turtle Bay. This is Turtle Bay Beach in Bermuda. We were going to go to Clearwater, and the driver kept driving uh, past Clearwater, and we saw this one, and we was like, nope, we need to get out, because look, there ain't but maybe 10 people here with us. And three were of color, and we're two. And uh, I know, right? And the airplane is, the the airport is right there. This is a, this is, this is, this is paradise, honey. Straight paradise. Okay, you guys, so I am here in Bermuda and I am at a restaurant called Gam Gambies. Is that what it's called? I think it's called Gambies. And I am trying their yummy sandwich, which is supposedly the best sandwich on the island. So here we go. They knew who were. Yes, yes, I know you all are probably wondering what exactly is this? Well, honey, it is a fried fish sandwich. And the type of fish on this sandwich is called Wahoo. Yes, the actual fish itself is called Wahoo. So it is on raisin bread, and I mean multiple pieces of fried fish. The sandwich was huge, huge, okay? So the fried fish, lettuce, tomato, coleslaw, butter, and then the sauce that they used to make the coleslaw, that's what they use as the mayonnaise. Bitch, what I tell you, Oh my God, it was just one of the best things I think I'd ever put in my mouth. And I'm just going to leave it at that. Bye. <laughs>
right? <laughs> I just want to know the history. When that makes a tall grass bend into lean, suddenly the raindrops that fall have to be. Hey, y'all. So, look, I have come to the end of the Bermuda trip. This is our final night here. We are leaving tomorrow at 2.30. Um, this is the ship back here. It's night. Also, I wanted to say a huge shout out to the fam bam over at the restaurant Gamby's. I saw them while I was here in Bermuda. I'm going to put a picture of us right after this clip so that you guys can see the food there was absolutely fantastic the drinks are good the bartenders were great we had a great time sean did you enjoy it uh fantastic it was a good time y'all it, it truly was yeah it was it was pretty bomb um but yeah so okay goodbye Well, you guys, this is it. We are getting ready to get back on the ship to leave Bermuda. So we are going to go have lunch. It has been a fantastic time here. Um, we've enjoyed it very much. Um, yeah, it's been a good time. So I'm going to go on ahead and sign off. Love you all. You guys, they have already started putting everything away. Uh, this is our last day here on the ship. Tomorrow morning when we get up at 6 a.m., we got to get the hell up out of here. So they've already pretty much kind of put everything away, as you guys can see. Um, it's been a blast. It really has been. Um, we will definitely be coming back on the Norwegian Escape for sure.
Y'all, it's really cool out here on this last night. You can tell that we are making our way back into New York City. The temperature is significantly dropping. Um, the humidity in Bermuda was damn near a killer on that last day. It was out there. But um, we are definitely making our way back because it is definitely getting cooler. That is for sure. You guys, we've made it back to New York City. Um, we're going to be debarking from the ship in probably about the next hour to hour and a half. Um, and then we're heading to the Amtrak to get us back home. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please make sure that you guys like, share, and subscribe. Um, if you guys have any questions or if you guys want any tips or tricks for your trip here in Bermuda, just let me know. Leave it down in the comment section below. And as always, y'all babies stay cute and take care. Bye.